Hi, this is Pavel from BeamObject. Today I have pleasure to show some new objects published on BeamObject.com portal, which have been created for Ellen Company. This company is producing elegant custom-made furniture for kitchens, wardrobes and libraries, all made on demand according to the wishes and the customer's needs. As you can see, you can easily browse the Ellen products. You just need to filter this company on BeamObject portal by its name. Right now we have 24 objects, representing some kitchen, wardrobe and library's furniture. Each product available on the portal has a separate product page, where you will find its description, classification and some additional data, like related information and regional availability. If you would like to check if selected object fits into your project, you can click this 3D button which allows to run a WebGL preview, where you can check the possible configurations and materials for each furnishing element. Moreover, each object has been prepared with different level of development, which means that you can show its geometry in the complex or simplified version. In this example I'm using this modern kitchen cabinet, but I would like to change its type to the cabinet with the sink place, change the main material to beach and top material let's say to the Bilbao sand. After clicking configure button I can see all changes and see how it looks in WebGL preview. This WebGL window allows you to check all possible configurations of the object. You can create your custom configuration and immediately see how it looks in selected version. If you would like to use Allen objects in ARCHICAD project, the best and most convenient way is to use our special add-on for this software, which will allow you to browse our database. You just need to search for the Allen objects, select the one which you want to use and click download. The library is automatically uploaded into your project. To place this kitchen inside my project, I need to select Object Menu, Link Libraries, Beam Object Library and Kitchen Modern Set LSEF file. Now I am able to place it in my project in 2D view and set it in a correct position. Rotate and place it in a corner. And now when I switch to 3D view, I am able to see this nice texture furniture. Of course, this object has also some additional configuration options. You can change LOD, which means level of development as well as colors of the worktop and the fronts. In this example I have set the worktop and the main color to one of wooden finishes delivered by the manufacturer. As I mentioned at the beginning of this movie, Ellen Company is able to provide custom furniture, with the fronts in any color from RAL or NCS palette. To represent it we created additional menu where you can pick any RAL color, right now there is more than 200 of them, or you can select any custom color with the color picker tool. Let's switch to the Revit software. Allen models are also available for this software, but they are compatible with the version 2015 or newer. Again, the most easy and convenient way to download these models is browsing the BeamObject portal with our special Revit add-on. This add-on is fully integrated with the Revit interface. After installing it, you just need to switch to the BeamObject tab click the Browse button and filter the Ellen brand products. You can do this by filtering the objects by selecting the Ellen name in the brands field. The most easy way is to start typing this name and you will see all names matching with the type letters. Let's say that I would like to use Kitchen Set Modern Line this time, so I need to click the Download button, select the format, it will be Revit of course, and just click the Download button. If the selected object has many different types included in the same family, as you can see in this case, you can select some specific types which you lose in the project. As you can see, I have this kitchen in my project, so right now I will place it somewhere in the 2D view and I will try to fit it into my room by dragging the corner of the kitchen and aligning it with the corner of the room. Let's switch to the 3D view to see how it looks in 3D. I will choose this 3D cross-section view. Here is my kitchen. I can of course change its colors and materials by selecting another type from the Revit menu. All Allen models include three levels of development, which can be changed in Revit with this button at the bottom menu. Here you can switch between coarse, medium and fine quality, which represents different complexity of the models. Each product is connected to its web page at Beam Object Portal, so if you would like to get more information about it, you just need to select it and click Info button. Then you are able to see the product page, where we gather all the information about this particular product. 
let's try to add another LN product to our project. This time it will be product with the customizable material. Let me switch to the floor plan of the first floor. I will place it somewhere here, so let's zoom in. Click the Beam Object plugin, Browse button, and I need to select the LN objects again by filtering the brands. This time I will use this bookcase from the classic line, but I will download the model with the customizable color palettes. This one here. I click download. OK, I have this object inside my project. Right now I will place it somewhere in the 2D view and align the corner with the corner of the room by selecting it and dragging to the desired position. Let's switch to the 3D view, to the 3D cross-section view, of course, this one, OK. To assign a custom material to this object, first you need to download the libraries prepared for the LN company, libraries with the materials. So we need to visit Beam Object Portal, click Download, but this time I will download materials and textures for Revit, and I save it. RAL Colors library and also LN materials and textures library. Next step is to unpack those two libraries into the specific location. In this case, it should be ln folder on the drive C. And you can drag also the raw colors into that location. Right now, I will select this object and go to Manage Materials, where I can find a material which this object is using by typing the name ln. And you will see this green one is Ellen custom main material. And right now I need to add those two libraries to Asset Browser. So I click Asset Browser, open existing library, and choose Ellen Textures, which, which contains Ellen Assets, and also RAL Colors, which contains more than 200 colors from the RAL palette. Now, if you would like to change this material, you can double click any of the colors, for example this salmon orange, and you can see that appearance of this material has changed, LN custom material has been changed, this is how it looks in a project. If you would like to change it to another one, you just need to select materials again, select this custom one again, but you can choose the color, for example, from the LN assets palette. Let's say that I would like to have this material maple white, so I click, double click it again, and here you can see how it looks, even with the realistic view with the texture. Thanks for watching and please visit beamobject.com. Bye!